I have a feeling obviously not all the questions are going to be answered in this game, seeing as there's a part three. Hopefully there's some kind of holy shit moments, you know? So, Kitsu, I gotta ask, how do you know about the Setra Temple anyway? Uh, well, like, uh, I wouldn't they say I know about it wouldn't exactly. Wouldn't say? Not directly, anyway. What's that supposed to mean? I just recall some document or other discussing its existence. If we can get to a Shinra terminal, I should be able to find it again. Terminal, huh? They said any up here? I think so. But I bet old Boogie will know for sure. I'd be interested to see how they do it from the original here, given the fact that we haven't met Mommy yet. What is Mommy? Spoilers, Phantom. Path of Return. Fucking shortcut down here the whole time. <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me if there was a part three. There is a part three. It's confirmed. This is, this is going to be a trilogy. That's been known for a long time. to the planet. Oh come on! We both know you didn't need to worry about me. After all, I am the son of Seto the Watcher. Forgive me. But if I recall correctly, Shinra should have set up a transmission terminal here in Cosmo Canyon. So, where is it? Oh, what did become of that thing? Ah, yes, now I remember. I was so fascinated by the technology it employed, uh, I did some tinkering. Some <laughs> tinkering, I say, though it was quite a lot. But now it serves a decidedly more practical purpose. You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> oh, well, do you know about a Setra temple? A temple, you say? If you mean a place where they worshipped gods, none exist. The Setra never engaged in such practices. I didn't know that. Maybe it was Earth. referred to as such by someone ignorant of their culture. If instead it is a site of importance to the Setra that you seek, texts do speak of one, and of the pains taken to conceal it. So, it does exist? Oh, ho, ho. Perhaps, though I know not where it is. Huh? And even should you find it, I would urge caution. They were a star-crossed people. To follow in their footsteps is to court tragedy. <sighs> However, the rewards may yet outweigh the risks. You must bring every one of your senses to bear. For then no secret will elude you, however well hidden. And when you return home, I hope you'll share your discoveries with me. Fellow Bugenhagen! What is it? I'm a little busy here. Another man in a black robe has come. What should we do? Well now, a friend of yours? Where'd you see him? Oh, uh, the village gate. We should check it out. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, fellow Bugenhagen. Uh, at first, in the settlement, I speak with the guides, and they will escort you to various locations in the settlement. A privileged service offered only to guests of fellow Bugenhagen. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Bugenhagen. Bugerhagen. Nanaki. Is this man okay? He is. Albeit rather weak. Not sure why, though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it, and this isn't it. Nebo. I am. Nebo. I am. Nebo. I am. Ain't that. Artifa and I grew up. Ah! Oh, of course! Nibelheim has a terminal. I bet my whiskers on it. Oh shit, we're going back to our childhood town. It, uh, had a terminal. Cloud, remember when you told Gee an attack back there? That I might be weird, but you can trust me. Hi. well, even if you were lying, I'm gonna prove to you that you can trust me. That I'm on your side. It's not that. We should go. Hey! 
Wait, <laughs> you're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? There's no roads you can take far as I know. Maybe we can't go by land. Said. But by air. Meaning we'll need smoke. Right then, back to the airstrip we go. Oh god. Alright, side quest time. Cloud. Proto relic energy signature confirmed. And relatively close to you. There you go. While the signal is Why on is the game? side, it may oh, serve as a good place to start. I'll send you the coordinates right away. <laughs> Back to the airstrip we go. After all this shit. Alrighty. And we also have you see that Which one's this? In. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? I've had games that ran this pause for years. Also true. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Uh, Portents of Cloudus Ruin have been sighted in the Veil of Late. Dreadful Fiends was very present in to Doom, but all is not lost yet. For in times past, we have observed celestial phenomena indicative of Great Mother's triumph over such forces. We request assistance with spotting and photographing said phenomena. Seek out Mentor Caesar for more info. Uh, it's been entirely too long since I've done some old-fashioned field work. I'd like to correct that. Unfortunately, I seem to have misplaced my tools. Drop by and lend a hand, will you? Go to the assembly. Yeah, I guess so. Two side quests more, and then the proto relic. Oh, I gotta take the picture for that guy as well. I've done most of this shit. Oh, fucking Shadley as well. Fuck it, Shadley. So I gotta go to the assembly. Are you in need of guidance? Fellow Bugenhagen told us to leave them be. And this is what we get for our inaction. I still think Bugenhagen's even. The seminar is in front. I mean, he's an old man. He's got to be old. And he's bald. All the time I was in here, listening. So it's upstairs. Observatory elevator. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? He's all in balls, probably, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, in fact, the older you are, the more evil you are. Preparing for field work. Haven't performed any in quite some time. At the moment, I'm trying to hunt down my tools. I must have buried them awfully well. But where? Field work? At your age? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Is he really Cajun the weapon is that instead of being the voice of the clay? Yeah, I mean he kinda said later, like, uh, you know, I didn't listen to him when they first said it, but it was still kinda of weird. I should 
that you will cut me off while you're still here. Very much. Shut up, Rucker. Go back to the I'll let you assist me. Good. Now, lay it on us. In truth, something has been troubling me as of late. Take a look at this. I'm old and evil. I have never sponsored his head. Are you sure this is accurate? It was at one point. Bro, the music's like overpowering the shit out of their voices. It rarely remained in one location for long. Oh, that rise to Indeed, such no. events move periodically. Yeah. Nothing unusual about that in the loop. However, it is not their positions which trouble me. Rather, what the survey team has reported. Mm hmm? Perhaps this fact-finding expedition of ours will clear things up. I would have you visit this site first. There, measure the Marco frequency using this meter of mine. All right, we'll do. Uh, press to view Bugenhagen's field report, and you all want to examine the document more closely and locate the Life Spring Survey Station. Okay. Use field report to find the first station. Go get the other quest. I don't know what the fuck it is then. Oh, this one is in the assembly hall. Okay. Uh, you can talk to my herbs anytime, can't I? Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Nanaki's companion, Nanaki. yes? Forgive me. I've yet to introduce myself. I am Caesar, one of the canyon's mentors. Now then, to answer your question, rather vile fiends have been sighted in the Vale. Ones believed to be portents of calamitous ruins. Scorpions? Really? The creatures have been observed on many occasions in times long since past. But always has our planet risen to the challenge, brought her might to bear and staved off disaster. It is through this unique celestial event that the planet provides us with proof of her victory. Is that a As you can see from these photographs, once the cataclysm has been averted and our world stands triumphant, gloriously resplendent comets grace the heavens. I don't see anything like that around here. Indeed. Though it should be said that none of these pictures were taken close by, but rather far from our current location. Perhaps we simply cannot see the miracles from here. The falling stars may have left their marks in the skies elsewhere. We're gonna go look for them, right? As if you'd ever take no for an answer. Truly? You would do this for us? It would be a great weight off our shoulders were you to find them. If you are serious, I suggest visiting the three locations in which the fiends were last seen. The signs we seek may show them. Oh so shit, good. dude. Here, use these reference materials and this recording instrument. Many man. Well, do I owe for the honor? Thank the you for the ten gifted spot. subs, man. Though try to ensure your pictures match ours. That's very Blessing generous of you, dude. Thank you very much. Hoggers, woggers. Okay. We can get out of here now. So the first life spring is like in there. Should be at least. Okay, a little pass, a little island. Already too. The airstrip. Okay, start banging these out. 
Yeah, it's me, Fincy. Well, did know as a the fuck is. Well, did know as a ventriloquist, flautist, flautriloquist. Is this under us? Guy from the Game Awards. Giga Chan. Looks like it's under us. Uh, or not? Oh no, it was above, I guess, looks like. draft here looks like uh -oh. -omen, 12 That's a big ass scorpion Air, evading fury bomb will pressure them. Reaper tail, frost, dealing enough damage with ice magic attacks will pressure them. Following up with fire damage will leave them open to attack. While pressure, they will become more susceptible to physical attacks but more resistant to magic. Interesting. Don't overdo it. All right, my time to shine. Clear me. You got this. It's on you. My turn. Use the phenomena using the phenomena reports as reference. Try to recreate the planetologist's photographs with at least 80% accuracy. Though Caesar will accept any picture you offer. Press to view the reports to press L1 to take a closer look. Once you have the right vantage point, pull out your camera and snap your shot. The picture. Right. Eh. Okay. Something like that. Mm, something's off. What? Apparently not. Well, it's pretty fucking good painting. What? What are you talking about? It looks, it looks the same almost. There you go. Nice. This is perfect. That's Jenna. It's the percent. Well, well, maybe you ought to add photographer to your resume. Let's look for other spots. Uh, we also need to find... Is this not just the well? 
Is it the actual wells that he wants us to go to? Seems like the right spot to me. What are we supposed to do here? To the first life spring. Take new measurements to compare those and periods so, of oh those things. Mm. Okay, okay. Uh, we found two of them. I remember. The other one is apparently around here somewhere. That's where those fences were. This is perfect. That's what I'm saying, dude. I see it. That's over there. Wait, there's a gate? How are we supposed to get past it? Or is there another entrance? <laughs> what the fuck? You'll need a key. It slipped my mind. Bro, if he can what go wherever the fuck he wants, why is he need to do home? this? Well, there's no need to make such a fuss. I simply wish to see this with my own eyes. Is he blind? Off while on the ball. Asking for a friend. I am the friend. So, if asking any questions. I'm not scared to ask the big questions. Oh, this is what those like warp pad things were. This guy. I see you're approaching the signal. The source appears to be somewhere in the canyon's ruins. These ruins are close, and it's thought that they were created to help guide it through the veil. I have complete faith your efforts will greatly aid our planet. I have mixed feelings. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> waiting. Her song is need to stop. There it is. Fuck are these guys? Yuffie! Nile! Hulk! Billy Bob! <laughs> Billy so Bob? It's very fucking you mechanic too. overall. We were worried you might not have made it out in time. Nothing can kill this bloom. Uh, <laughs> clearly, 
Exactly, hmm? Casual. Say, world's biggest butt so plug. Um, here. Hey, you three! <gasps> Splinter Cell. Well, where are my manners? These guys are from Avalanche HQ. They're the ones who helped me out back oh, in Oh, weren't these guys from, uh... I don't think they need an introduction. Intermission or whatever the DLC was. You were Shinra building, weren't you? I recognize the chick. Tell me. Was Wade with you? Or did you see him? If yeah, I you can that tell name. me anything, anything at all, please. Wedge, he... I'm sorry. Don't be. Just... I need to know. Oh, shit, dude. After the Sector 7 plate fell, the things we saw and heard... All the carnage... It was... Hell. We wanted to help. We really did. But how? It all seemed so hopeless. That's when the call came. From the folks at Avalanche HQ. We learned it was the company that dropped the plate. And that they were gonna drop another. Unless we stopped them. HQ needed volunteers. To help storm the Shinra building. This was our chance. We knew it was the right thing to do. All of us. Wedge and I ended up being assigned to the same truck. Group Wedge. Gen Core. We'll infiltrate the building via the underground parking facility. From there, we make our way up, taking each and every floor. Hmm. We've lost contact like, with the flashes, team. though. It's a glitched frame or something. That's enough. First, We'll check him with man. Which is a All sandwich right. in his hand. Let me just scooch on over here. I'm Wedge with the splinter cell. He's dual wielding sandwiches. That's true, right? Mm -hmm. Here, try one of these. It'll help you calm down. Thank you. Go on, eat a... <laughs> Wait a minute, there's no bite mark in the sandwich. Yet he took a bite. Our team was heading upstairs to take out the president. I know what you're thinking. Avalanche doesn't do that. But when the plate fell, the rules changed. <sighs> Who stole it and sent him to hell? Yeah. yeah! I've got friends up there who need to know we're coming. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, but I didn't want them to get hurt, sir. <laughs> the fuck is that guy? Go, I'll catch up. Ray. We were all fired up, ready to fight. I keep surrounding them. Oh, well, I don't remember. Now that you mentioned it, I vaguely remember something like that. <laughs> Rip Wedge. Spirits killed Wedge. What the fuck, dude? We couldn't believe it. It was him. <laughs> 